Wow, now that was a crossover. that this earth belongs to us. We will not surrender. We will not back down. We will keep fighting. So get the hell off our earth while you still can. Crisis on Earth X. All right, so Crisis on Earth X is a four-part crossover on the CW shows. It was a crossover of Supergirl, The Flash, Arrow, and Legends of Tomorrow. And the basic story of this is, is that Barry, Barry and Iris are getting married and they send out with invitations to a bunch of people throughout the multiverse. They, they invite Kara from from Earth-19. They invite the Legends from wherever in time they're from and Oliver and his crew from uh, Star City. I just say I very much enjoy this crossover. Here's what I'll tell you about this crossover. The basic premise of it is there's a wedding and Nazis come to attack them, and they're they're trying to get something out of them. And then you, turn, you find out that the that their doppelgangers are actually Nazis at, from Earth X. And it was a very fun crossover. One thing I will tell you: if you don't watch a show, any of these shows, don't worry. You can you can go into the show completely blind, never watching a sh anything, and have a really fun time with it. This was a very it was a very isolated story. And I had a really good time watching this crossover. It felt like a more like a four. It felt like a two and a half hour movie more than anything because you had to watch part one was on Supergirl, part two was on Arrow, part three was on Splash, and part four was on Legend of Tomorrow. And it had some really cool stuff in there. And whenever you see all these, when all you see all these heroes fight together, it was freaking awesome. The movie, there's this. Actually, I call it this special. Kind of remind me of the first Avengers, and there is a death in this uh, show, and I would, I would, I was like, holy crap! I had a feeling they're going to just write him off the show, but I, I was really impressed the way they did, and it, it kind of felt like stakes. It kind of felt like in the, the original Avengers movie when they killed off Agent Coulson, and it kind of had that kind of grabbing haunts to it. But like I said, when all the heroes are fighting together, it was great, and. One thing I will say was that I really like Stephen Amell's evil, his evil self, uh, the evil Nazi Fuhrer. He was the Fuhrer of Earth X uh, for the, the Nazi Reich. I really enjoyed his character in the show. And it was cool seeing other characters pop up in and there. And it was great just seeing all these uh, smaller characters show up. And when they're all fighting, it's just, it's just, it's a great time. So guys, I recommend checking out Crisis on Earth X. It's a very enjoyable crossover. And it's a good time. Check it out. So, guys, have you seen Crisis on Earth X? And what are your thoughts? Comment below. Let me know. And, guys, if you like this video, click that thumbs up button. Subscribe to see more. And tell your friends about Easy Nation. All too easy.